तक्त धीम तकिट धीम तीम तत्म For those of us who like embodied traditions and expressions, I include myself, self-enquiry can be a really off-putting word because it has connotations of the intellect and analysis and text and theories and a sort of dryness to it. I understand that, but there is a way in which the self-enquiry can be embodied and there is a way in which dance uh, can be an expression of self inquiry and this is not something new because this was how dance was practiced in many ritual and archetypal traditions um, centuries ago in most ancient times in different parts of the world this was the role that ceremonial ritual dance fulfilled now dance in this kind of uh context in the context of self inquiry is very different to the usual ways in which we dance so this is not dance as a performance or for mastery to be a professional dancer or even as a recreation it is a very specific um, modality where there is uh, there is it's a it's a ritualistic form of expression therefore there are the presence of deities and archetypes and the dance language itself is has a very particular um a sophistication and a particular dynamic so the way in which you teach the way in which you receive it and the way that you manifest it in your life all of this is quite different to the usual ways in which we consider dance and dance as self inquiry is um to me is a very important way in the time in the times that we live in because it truly offers a freedom from a mind led ways of exploring our consciousness and exploring uh, who we are in the depths of ourselves it allows us to really bring everything back into our body and to the beauty of the body and the intelligence of the body which is multisensorial which is of movement and which is of expression because the body is built to be sensorial and to be able to express and when we uh, express our self inquiry it becomes a material reality it becomes an embodied reality it's not a theory it's not somebody else's um knowledge or teaching that we are simply imitating or manifesting but it truly becomes something of our inquiry because we are each one of us we are a different being we are uh, like the infinite plurality of nature we are infinitely different from each other and this kind of dancing where dance is a self inquiry we are really given the space to express that uniqueness and in a paradoxical way it is when we go to that uniqueness and that expression of uniqueness within us that we really become part of the plurality of nature itself so it is not simply by following something that actually separates us from everything else but it that everythingness of reality is available to us when we go to our uniqueness which is through our body and the expression of the language of the body which is this sort of archetypal dancing so yes absolutely uh, embodied practices like dance can be a beautiful way of self inquiry